We're going to make some Sweet Baby Ray's Barbecue Sauce Wine. Got to get the award winning Sweet Baby Ray's Barbecue Sauce. All right, I'm going to get a gallon of spring water. I'm going to fill this pot about halfway. And then you want to discard some of this. You want to discard some of this gallon. Let's go ahead and pour some in a bowl. So it's about, about half left. Now you want to take your Sweet Baby Ray's. This is a uh, 40 ounces. This is two pounds, eight ounces. We're not going to use. We're not going to use the whole thing. We're going to get more than a pound. At least the whole 16 ounce bottle. We want to do that. We'll save that and put it on support or something. That'd be good. You want at least 16 ounces. I'd say I probably used about 24 ounces, maybe 30. Now we're going to stir this up and let this cook on high heat. A cup of sugar. I'm going to keep it stirred with a whisk. I'm going to stir it until it starts to boil. Then we're going to turn the heat off. Alright, once it starts to get almost boiling, I'm going to pour that in a bowl. I poured it straight in here, but I'm going to have this little nipple here. And once that's in there, we pour it back in a jug. Video. Mm -hmm. I got a packet of EC 1118 Lauven yeast. I'm gonna put it in here. I got it at, at about 97 degrees. Make sure you have a thermometer. Make sure you microwave this water. You get a temperature reading of at least 97 degrees. And aerate it. Get some air bubbles in there. And wait five minutes. I'm going to pour it in a jug. And we're going to start making some wine. Make sure this cools down to less than 98 degrees. You want this at room temperature before you add this yeast. It's been a little bit. It's cooled down. We're gonna make some wine. Sweet baby rays, motherfucker! Now we're gonna dump our yeast in here. That yeast. It's about to have a feeding frenzy. Now, put our airlock on there. We're going to put some water in here. Put it in a warm place, safe from the sunlight. For at least two weeks or until this stops bubbling all right we're gonna move our sweet baby rays barbecue sauce wine into a secondary vessel which is another fucking water jug <laughs> i'm gonna use this siphon it's been working well i like it it's my new toy it costs like five bucks you could pour you can do it any which way you want. Put that siphon on there and make sure the one water jug is lower than the other. You set it on the ground, it goes quick. Look 
of that shit. That's going quick. Put it in there and let it sit a couple days. Cold crash it in the refrigerator. And then we'll bottle it. Keep in mind that I bottle early. If, you know, it sits for a couple months, I'll rebottle it. Leave the sludge at the bottom of the, the old bottles, rinse them out. I don't want to wait, you know, six months just to try wine I made. I want to try it after a month. And then, you know, put it up. But, you know, mainly I do this to show everybody how easy this shit is. And we could use some new people in the hobby. You get a lot of wine snobs out there that, are, that make it look so hard. And, and they make everybody feel dumb. Fuck them people. I don't want to do two wines a year. I want to do 20 or 30 or up to a fucking 100. That's it. Get in the sludge. Fuck it. It's got a screen on it. See what it does. It clogs up. <laughs> yeah. Let's go below the sludge. See what happens. It's clogged, damn it. Yeah. A lot of sludge from that barbecue sauce. It's all good. That's good. I mean, if we get half a gallon out of it, I'm good. Look at that. Oh shit, look how pretty that is. Sweet Baby Ray's. You know Sweet Baby Ray's from Chicago? Is it? The white guy from Chicago. He makes some good ass barbecue sauce. <laughs> I always saw you as old black guy. I love, I love it. Fuck barbecue sauce, dude. Sweet baby. Put our airlock back on. Come back in a few days. All right, we're, we're about to bottle our barbecue sauce, our sweet baby raised barbecue sauce wine. We got this cool little siphon we put in here. This thing costs like five bucks. It's well worth it. Put your bottles lower than your jug. There you go. There you go. They go quick down down yonder. <coughs> Yellow in that glass, don't it? It is. It's all red up here. It could be from the sediment in the bottom. I hope it's good, man. I can't wait to taste it. Man, I'm intrigued. <laughs> it's good and clear. The best part about being so cold outside, you can cold shock shit outside. Yeah. Yeah, we cold crashed this. We let it sit in the secondary a few days, and then we cold crashed it for about three more days. I need a little bit more. That's it. Oh, what it smells like, motherfucker, pull the pork, boy. <laughs> Shit, three of them. 
Yeah, I was surprised. I thought they were doing one too. Good towel. Now we're going to try this Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce wine. It smells like barbecue sauce. It tastes like barbecue too. It makes me want to pull pork sandwich with some coleslaw on it. <laughs> you taste the wine? Oh yeah, it's strong. It'd get you drunk. It's good too. It's just different. That's good. That's not bad at all. Matter of fact, I think I like this better than a peanut butter wine. I think it tastes a little better. Yeah, that's a hit, dude. Sweet baby rays. Look at that. That's beautiful. What do you think? It smells like barbecue sauce. It tastes like barbecue sauce. That's strong. I like it better than peanut butter wine. It's setting the bar real high. <laughs> but peanut butter wine's good. Shut the fuck up. Oh, I don't like a peanut butter wine. This ain't bad. I couldn't see drinking a lot of it, but it should be good to cook with. Shit. That's good to drink. <laughs> <laughs> just don't put no sauce on your Sammy, you know what I'm oh, saying? <laughs> just drink it. <laughs>